Hey guys, welcome to the very first Lifestar EMS NVVent how-to video. Today we're going to be talking about how to perform a circuit test, which is important because every time you hook up a new circuit to the vent, you have to do a test to make sure that it's not leaking and that it's going to be safe for patient use. So let's jump right in. The very first step is hit the power button on the bottom left hand side. Once it powers up, you're going to be shown a few options and you're going to go all the way to the bottom and click vent setup. You'll be taken to another screen and at the very top you'll see there it says EST. Go ahead and click that. Now you'll notice way up at the top it says waiting 44, 43, 42 and that's the vent performing self tests so it's not ready to perform the test yet. So what you're going to go ahead and do is grab your circuit and then we're going to tighten it. So start at the top, tighten it here at the Y and then go and follow down you'll see a water trap right here and this is another spot where it can leak so go ahead and tighten that. Now that it's tightened, you can go ahead and attach it to the vent. This is the inhalation limb, and then the exhalation limb is going to go on right now, and that's the one with the water trap on it. Then you'll see these two sensors. They can only go on one way. One is female threaded, one is male threaded. So what you can do is give them a counter turn, let them start to thread themselves on, and then go ahead and give them a small tighten. Same thing, counter turn, let it thread on, and then tighten it so they don't fall off. So now that it's tightened and attached, you can go back to that screen, you'll notice the countdown is done, and be ready to occlude it. So we hit start, and the vent ramps up, you can hear the blower going, and then we occlude it. And then it's going to pressurize the circuit and look for any leaks. So we keep our finger on there, and it has passed. So now we're ready to actually hook it up to a test lung. We're going to back out of here, we're going to hit new patient, and then we're going to hit next and then intubated. And before we hit ventilate, we'll go ahead and take a test lung here and attach it. And once we hit ventilate, it'll start ventilating that test lung. And that'll allow us to put settings in for our patient before we actually attach it to the patient. And uh, we'll talk about settings in a later video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.